Hey guys, welcome back to our repair guys. In today's video guys, we'll be working here on the BMW, the 3 series and we'll show you guys uh, where the camshaft position sensors are located on that thing and how to replace them. You have two of them, intake and exhaust. Uh, if you have a 3 series guys, uh, even if you have like a 5 series as well, X3, they use that engine. So if you have a car from BMW from 2006 to 2013, it's very possible that this will be the same procedure. Uh, we'll have more than 200 videos guys on this BMW, so please subscribe to the channel also. Uh, we just started a new channel, okay, it's called Electrical Car Repair Life. Please subscribe guys, it will mean a lot. We have only electrical components there, more information, more engine codes and things like that. So, let's start on it now. So, this is the intake one, you can see it's on the side of the intake. We're going to use a reverse torque socket, let me show you the socket. Okay, let me focus here. It's called a reverse Torx 8. It's star looking socket, okay. And we'll need to go ahead and remove that bolt all the way. Both sensors will be identical procedure to replace. You do not have to take the whole front end of the car off. We're just rebuilding this one. We got it from a car auction. I wrecked in the phone, really good price. So check out the video if you're interested. Okay, get a screwdriver and just gently pry the sensor out of there. Okay, now, now right here, we need to lift it up. Okay, and pull the wire out, just like that. Okay, this is the intake camshaft position sensor. Now the exhaust one, okay, is right there. So we're going to remove this one too. You can see it's the same way, with the same two. We just need to go ahead and remove the bolt. We have a valve cover gasket replacement, mechanical, electrical components covered. But check out the new channel, that electrical car repair life. Quite a few videos coming there, guys. Okay, second one is about to come out. This is the exhaust one, on the exhaust side. You can pull the hose out of the way here so you can access it better, okay. And you might notice oil leaks from there if the O-rings are old. So we'll need to disconnect this one in the same way that we disconnected the first one. And you can see those guys, okay let me grab them quick, are the two sensors out of the BMW. Okay right here, two of them. Uh, in my opinion, I need to double check but I think they're interchangeable, left and right one. Uh, so that's how you guys remove them, you put everything together in reverse order, we took it apart. Thank you for watching, see you guys next time.